The title of the tape speaks for itself. Both these sides are littered with quality, littered with experience, internationals, but the Jaguares side is a wounded animal. They're going to come out guns blazing. They haven't had back-to-back -back losses since March 2018. The Bulls have never won in Buenos Aires. Well played by Nyakani. This is good for the Bulls. Jason Jenkins taking it up to the 22-meter line. Papier, Pollard took his eyes off it. Brilliant pickup. Now it looks like it's Orlando who's got the ball, looking for support. He's run away from the defenders, though. And a beautiful try by Matthias Orlando. A ball that's spilled by the Bulls, and Orlando pounces on it. I must say, some soft defending from the Bulls, slipping off tackles there. That should have gone to ground. But take nothing away from Orlando. A lot of work to do. And he reaps the rewards. And half time it is. So it's uh, been very, very wet, which has uh, just uh, been unfortunate for the spectacle. 7 3, the Hawaras lead. And another really good strike by Pollard. A golden opportunity for the Bulls to get their scoreboard ticking over again. Well, the pressure will be on if Pollard can boot this one over. Just one point will be in it. And Pollard, like a machine, well, it's a good ball set up for the Hawari Sian to be desperate to defense. They've taken it over, and the referee's arm is up for a try. Oh, it's a good driving ball by this Hawari Sian, too easy, and it's the replacement flanker. Bruni who gets the score. Backwards, play on. Well, now it's not forward and well done there by uh, Eli Sneiman not to play that ball. Bulls are slipping off too many tackles and now there's an overlap here. Orlando on the outside, chance here for Delgi. It's a lovely step by the young winger, and that could put the game beyond the Bulls' grasp. Well, they've only got a 78% tackle completion rate compared to last week's 92%. And that was the difference against the Stormers. But Delgi, outstanding, good handling from this Argentine side. And that picture tells a story. And so the Hawares win at home in dreadful conditions at 27 points to 12.